Welcome back to Fix Your Apps. In today's video, we'll show you exactly how to use Microsoft Word in Android phone quickly and easily. Now let's get started. First, open the Google Play Store on your Android phone. This is where you can download apps, and it's usually found right on your home screen or in your app drawer. Next, search for Microsoft Word Edit Documents using the search bar at the top. This is the official Word app by Microsoft, made specifically for editing and creating documents. Now tap the Install button to start downloading and installing the app on your phone. Make sure you're connected to the internet so it installs without any delay. Once the app is installed, tap Open to launch Microsoft Word. The app will open to a welcome screen where you can be begin setting things up. You'll be asked to log in with your Microsoft account, but you can also skip this step if you just want to explore the app first. Logging in will let you sync documents across devices and access OneDrive. A free trial screen might appear, but don't worry, you can simply skip it if you're not interested in premium features. You'll still be able to use the basic tools for editing and creating documents. Now to open or create a document, tap the plus button on the main screen. This lets you start a new document or choose an existing one from your phone. To access your files, tap open, then select a different location when prompted. This option helps you browse outside of the default cloud storage. Choose this device to browse the documents stored directly on your phone. It allows you to open files you've downloaded or transferred. If the app asks for file permissions, go to your phone settings and allow access to files. This is important, as Word needs permission to open and save files on your device. Once permissions are granted, return to the Word app, pick your file from storage or downloads, and start editing. You can now write, format, and save documents just like on a computer. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to Fix Your Apps for more helpful tutorials.